but she said, go across the street here to the pawn shop and check out the mummified mermaids. Need a gator skin? This was my favorite cereal growing up. With many great options for a weekend getaway, John and I decided to head east into the mining district of Idaho. Decided to head east a little bit down Highway 90 and check out Wallace, uh, which is kind of a old mining town. And we're going to go check it out and then try to find a place to camp. And tomorrow, maybe do the Pulaski Trail. This is also the on the rails to trails, uh, which we want to do the rest of it. Last year, we did part from uh, Pullman to Coeur Lake Coeur d'Alene, and you can go a lot farther. And this is part of it. Looks like there's some kind of fair going on down here. We wanted to go to the Bordello Museum, but it looks like it's closed. Founded in 1884, Wallace is part of the Silver Valley Mining District in the Panhandle of Idaho. The district produced more silver than any mining district in the U.S. Wallace has plenty of museums, so we headed for the Wallace District Mining Museum where we got tons of great information Interest. from a knowledgeable local. Okay. It's not your fault, it's a museum. Ever seen a typewriter like this? A photography museum here, railroad museum, but to get to Pulaski. You're gonna drive to it, mm -hmm. because then it's a two mile trail. So you, okay. from here, you go around, you go down Cedar Street. Really great lady in this uh, museum, in the mining museum. And uh, I do recommend you stop there for great information and check it out. But she said, go across the street here to the pawn shop and check out the mummified mermaid. So that's what we're gonna do next. Seen the mermaid yet? Here it is. A mummified mermaid. What is it? Is this like the thing? First cousin to the thing. Wow. Need a gator skin? Owen? This was my favorite cereal growing up. It got soggy in milk. Boy, I wish they had that still. That absolutely made my day. Seeing a sticker with the word crumbles on it. That was just a blast from the past. The entire town of Wallace is listed on the National Register of Historic Places. We stopped in one of the former bordellos for a cold drink before wandering down to the Northern Pacific Depot Railroad Museum. For a nominal fee, you can go it alone or you can discover the past with the help of a delightful tour guide. You go from Chicago as a tail all the way up and you see Idaho up there. Uh -huh. Which president was it? Teddy Roosevelt. Oh, Roosevelt. Oh, awesome. Is this town building? Is this that building? That's our building. That's right. You can see the ladies up there. Here, town. What, the false front the of, false in front, front of the which the hotel was it? Well, it's... It was this whole area here. You know, that was, whole area was whole, for was bordellos. This whole area. Okay, so the where we just had coffee with Yeah. Okay. So that's the oldest building and that was and that was a bordello? That was a bordello. Okay. And downstairs was the commercial. Uh-huh. And two hundred feet, transport two hundred feet across oh. the bridge. Oh, so it was moved here. <laughs> yeah, I met her. She She's a real stiff. <laughs> this is a same partner desk in 1911. Which one are you? 
<laughs> I'm probably in a, I've been resurrected. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, here, I'll answer the phone. You don't My have friend to do this. has one of these. Hello? Train leaves in platform two in five minutes. There you go. Forty words in the cipher. Wow. He's doing cyphers. <laughs> oh my. You won't find this in any of your peaks for this now. Okay, always something. Okay, now we're gonna go try to find a dispersed camping spot. This is the spot we picked out. There wasn't a lot to choose from, but it's right off of a forest service road and there's virtually no traffic. The OHV guys stopped a long time ago and this will put us really close to the trailhead for our hike tomorrow. Wallace is not only known for its mining history, but also for the story of heroic firefighters who battled the big burn of August 1910. Hundreds of wildfires were burning across the Northern Rockies. Three million acres were burned in 36 hours, and 78 firefighters lost their lives. The Pulaski Trail, just outside Wallace, was our main reason for visiting Wallace. It is the story of Assistant Forest Ranger Ed Pulaski and his crew of 45 men. During the two-day peak of the fire, referred to as the Big Burn, or Big Blow Up, Pulaski and his crew became trapped by the fire. Due to his knowledge of the area, he directed his men to take refuge in a mine tunnel where all but five escaped death. Another bridge. This was quite a trail to build. We spent a lot of resources on this. This is a beautiful trail on the creek. So this tree is from the 1910 fire. Jump start with dynamite, wet weather. <laughs> they floated a hot air balloon up. Oh my gosh. All the way to Chicago with the smoke. Wow. Can you imagine saying goodbye to your wife, telling her you may not see her again? That's Pulaski's wife. He obviously brought her up here to show her. Two burned men and injured men, fresh from the fires. Wow. Left me with poor eyes, weak lungs, and throat, but thank God I am now, I am not now blind. Check out the mine entrance get down there, but there's the entrance to the mine. 
He is also credited with contributing to the design and widespread use of the Pulaski tool. I don't see how he even found the mine. With all this, how thick the forests are here. Well, my hat's off to all these firefighters because they work their butts off for very little pay. And pretty amazing trail that they built here. Beautiful shape, wonderful displays. It's definitely worth a stop and it's it pretty easy. Right now it took us uh, an hour and 15 minutes to get up here and that's with all the stops. And it is uh, just steepest at the last half mile. Before that, it's pretty, pretty smooth uphill, don't you think? So now we should be back in less than an hour and off to dump our tanks and then to the farmer's market where they have, uh, what was the name of those, those uh, scone scones? Ranger. The Scone Ranger. Those are awesome scones. We hope they're not out by the time we get there. Voila! out of some and uh, we're gonna now split a jalapeno lime scone mm, spicy sweet 